Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, people. Good morning, people. Good morning, people. Hi, are you people? Hi, are you people? Good morning, good morning, good morning. I hope you guys are all blessed today. People are so jacked up and weird and like, especially if you know that they're being ugly and they be doing weird stuff. I just seen a picture and it was a girl. She was doing her, her, her single, her first single. I don't know. But she was doing it with the celebrity, and they looked it really pretty on there. Both of them are, you know, celebrities or whatever, whatever, whatnot. But I couldn't get the message right of the picture, and I don't know what type of message they were trying to send out. But apparently they thought they were sending it out for, you know, towards someone. Like, I don't get it. I don't see how... People can use their energy unless it's something empty in you. The only reason why you would be using your energy to like try to get at other people is if it's something wrong with you and you're really insecure and you really got issues going on with a person because of your own stinky thinking or whatever or you know you try to project stuff out to be in a competition or think you're sending slugs like I don't really get it because, you know, I don't waste a lot of time on stuff like that, like doing stuff like that to people, you know, because in the end, like, what is it going to do for me? Like their picture was really, really pretty and they were both on their, you know, naked or whatever, but neither one of them was crying, but um, the girl had at the top of her picture still crying. Like, I don't get it. And the song was nothing about crying. Like, they were on there naked, exposing themselves and talking about what they can do. But she slapped a picture on there and, like, is this some, one of, uh, another one of your tactics or your people that you're using to, like, send out a message? Like, I don't know. It's just me. I see stuff before it happened and I know what people be doing and it's like ugly like you start to look at them like yeah she you know she was pretty but just that thing right there like I don't get it like what message because she's not crying on the picture so still crying is her heart crying or what because the video that they made was totally not to do with anything of crying so I don't understand. I don't understand people, but that lets you know who you are and that lets you know who they are because <laughs> they're weird. Like, I'm like, who are you talking to? Who are you trying to send a message to? Because to maybe, a, well, let me shut up. Maybe she's sending that to a guy that she was with and maybe her heart is still crying out for that person I don't know I just be knowing things about what people be doing and you could think that you know they're good they're cute they have a lot of subscribers they be doing their thing they be on their money they be rich people and all that but they be sick like y'all need to come to the um treasure chest box class because you're going to learn all about that like a person could have everything that they want in life or whatever and still be miserable and jealous of someone that don't even got as much as them it's just all bad it's sickening people are sickening they really are I just I, I pity the fool for these people I, I really feel sorry for a lot of them because you like you could look at them on the outer surface and then you'd be like, damn, you rather go praise this person instead of praising God where he can help you and 
He can give you just as much as that person got spiritually and physically. Like, you know, it's all bad because I never thought of my giftings or whatever to be used and taken and putting my personal um, personal testimonies and stuff flipped and t t my ideas taken to be put in movies and stuff for people to make money that are already rich people. Like, that's what's pissing me off. I never thought that they would do so. Success ain't got anything to do with it. But, you know, anyways, I need to get off of that. And, guys, if you can let it go, I know it's a lot of people who have been taken from. Um, just let it go and let God have it. It's easier said than done. But, like, it'll come back on them, people. You don't have to worry. You don't have to worry. Like, I'm not crying over spilled milk anymore. If I sit up here and cry about what these people have taken all of my personal items, my testimony and all my stuff. And I go on, girl, I'll be going just like more stories that I have that I have experienced it. And I've seen someone else go through in life. I'll be sitting up here pouting for the rest of my life. If I cry over what these people already taken from me, like, you know, no, for me to put my items out, I didn't think they were going to take them and use them and make money off of them. No, I absolutely did not think that. But nevertheless, it just goes to show you that people that are seen in a great big light, like when you're unhealed, you are unhealed. It just because you go and make something of yourself and become a celebrity, an actress, an artist, a doctor, a lawyer. If you're a bad person and you had ugly stuff in your heart, if you don't surrender up to the universe and you don't change your ways and you don't start healing stuff that childhood traumas or things that have happened to you, it just get worse. As you get start making more money and able to maneuver your way through life and do a lot more in life or whatever, it just get worse. Those people are able to pay people. They're, you know, they got people looking up to them, not knowing that this person is the most sickest person you would ever want to come across. I'm telling you, God told me it's not the people with the retarded face that is effed up. It's people with the straight face that you better be looking out for because your ass is going to be in for a rude awakening. He has met a new person at a bar. They're blocked. Keep up with how much money you're spending. This is out. They had a sex with the, another person beside the Cormac. So he have met a new person. Your person or whoever you got blocked, they, met, they secretly love you. Meeting your soulmate soon. So, someone's going to be meeting their soulmate soon. Someone could have been stagnated and stuck. Didn't really know which way that you guys needed to go in. What direction you needed to go in. What I'm getting here is, this is a person that you have blocked or whatever. They have met a new person. This could be a, a karmic person that you were with in the past. This is a person that three of pentacles like to uh, do it for the public, like to keep people in third parties for money, like to take action towards people for money really fast. And whoever they met in this bar, it could be for sex or just money or whatever. But this could be an earth sign or what I'm getting in the past or what I'm getting, this person had a karmic person that was trying to go after the masculine that you were connected to or whatever. Like he was seeing that person, someone that you know, and also seeing also he's met a new person as well. So he's been trying to work his way out of like um, dealing with whoever this person was that you that tried to break up the connection between you and them. 
this person, whoever this person was, or whatever is um, seven of swords, they were being deceptive. They were taking your items and leaving evidence or the person that you know about or whatever, whoever this karmic person is, she was, uh, she was taking items from you, like maybe copying you, maybe trying to be like you, maybe acting as you were. And this person, she thought that she was more than you was or whatever. She thought she, you know, uh, to flaunt money or try to present like maybe where she work at or what she drive or where she live or that she's buying her home, that she have a lot of, you know, out of surface things or whatever going on she wanted him to look at her like that she was uh higher than you two of pentacles and this is like it was all an illusion like some type of work that you guys do yeah she wanted him to leave you out in the cold and he did five of pentacles they had sex with another person beside the cormac yeah, this person have been with other people. Like he haven't been just with this person that caused the uh the departure between you and them. This whoever this karmic person was, she wanted you out in the cold and you went and you shine the light on the situation and you were telling him this person, Queen of Wands, this could have been a passionate, like her outer surface is very lustful or you know, she keep up with herself. She's passionate about, you know, trying to think she's making people jealous or something of that nature. Queen of Wands. And she passionately caused a departure between you and the person you were connected to. This person could act as though she was passionate about, you know, um, work or about helping the community or doing things, you know, to help the poor or charity or this person can act passionate, but she was still a copycatter. She was taking items. She was watching you taking, but trying to make herself seem like she was better than you were. And justice is getting ready to prevail for that. Justice, you could have been fighting with this divine masculine or this karmic and the masculine and everyone around you. At the time you were fighting all of them or whatever, um, trying to get out of this or this masculine could be fighting him and this karmic and other people are having it out at this particular moment. They could be on the Internet, like spearing out arguments or in a group setting or something or whatever, something, the same fights that they caused between you and this uh, divine masculine they're having them as well right now eight of pentacles yeah you could be working hard and trying to uh, stack up stability for yourself but be careful because people are watching you or be careful keep up with how much money that you're spending because you could be overspending and you may need it You're, you may need it. You could be trying to work hard to gain pinnacles. Who is this that secretly love someone here? Who is this that secretly loves someone? Someone that may have caused a third party. Ooh, I don't know, but the tower is here. For someone that secretly love you, I don't know you... Because of all the fights that this person caused you and because this person allowed, you know, was so weak minded and allowed this person to come in and act as though she was better than you. You may be deciding to not take this person back. And that's going to be the tower because um, this person is really secretly, secretly in love with you. But you may decide to not because it was too much of a hassle and people have been everything that you've been working for. It's been unbalanced. You block people and everything else. So you're trying to establish like more stability or whatever. And people are fighting against you and they were fighting against you as well. 
So you may be just deciding to cut this off and not deal with this situation. You don't want to deal with it. Yeah. Whoever this soulmate is, or whatever could be a water sign that you put a death to, you could be meeting up with them soon. I don't know. You you might be meeting up with your soulmate soon. Someone is trying to get in the middle or in between a connection that you and someone could could be doing. Someone caused a backstabbing or someone is trying to cause a backstabbing or someone want to come in and cause a fight with you or whatever because they hate to be rejected. Ooh, I don't know. Damn. Damn. A Scorpio and a Cancer is here. Who is the soulmate? What is the secret? Someone is resting right now. What is the secret? Both of these people could be coming towards you because of money or secretly been watching you. These are people that cause fights with you, with you and people around you. But you're going to have the victory of this matter. Like, wait a minute. Let me see, y'all. What is, who's the soulmate? Let's see if a sign will come out. Who's, who's, you're going to have a victory. If someone was trying to be secretive and cause fights and do things behind your back, and create illusions and stuff, you're going to have the victory. You're going to five of swords, fight all of them, and have them. Uh, uh, you already, it's like you had to fight against a bunch of dark people, and you're going to have the victory out of this. What is the moon? is the moon or two people could be willing to someone a Scorpio could be one of these persons is your soulmate for real for real and a Scorpio could be trying willing to fight with someone that's seen in a great big lead seen in a that's in a leadership position they got dark people around them that praise them their ego, they're up on a high pedestal or whatever. They're stuck. They're blind. They can't even see. This could be a fire sign. This could be someone that one of these persons is dealing with. This person wanted to get some type of recognition or something. What is this cancer? What is the moon card? What is the moon? Because... It says that someone is stuck and they're in a leadership position with blinders on. They're really stuck. Who is this? Oh, this is someone want to have sex. Someone sees you as a star. Someone wants to come in like a flight night, night of cups. And cause an illusion, but they're really coming in because they know you know how to manifest pinnacles. Night of one, someone wants to even have sex with you. They know that you're healing. They see you as a star. This is what the secret is. Someone just want to be around someone for money or want to come in and have a connection with someone for money. Who is this five of cups? Someone that you left feeling sorrowful because of the way they treated you or did you or whatever. Someone's going to be left feeling sorrowful. This is a water sign for sure. And it's two water signs right there. Someone is willing to fight over you. 
And it's all because of money. They want to come back towards you because they know that you know how to manifest or something. You got something that they need to manifest or something of this nature. It is a bunch of grimy people around you that just want you for money. And you are going to turn your back. You've been enlightened by this and you're explaining to them what's been going on and six of swords you're getting in you've been waiting for your ships to come in you're gonna walk away you're gonna sell away from this the whole thing you don't want to deal with no one is what i'm getting you're gonna leave from the whole situation yes and you're gonna have justice in your money queen of pentacles because the devil you see them as the devil. Clarify the devil. Queen of Pentacles. You're going to have justice. Because you're the queen of Pentacles. You're going to have justice. If you move away from this. Regardless. You're going to still. Clarify the devil. If you move away from this. You're going to have justice in your money. In your home life. To do with work. And all of that. Because you're the queen of Pentacles. Clarify the devil. Clarify the devil. Clarify the devil. Oh, King of Wands and the Ten of Cups. What? Someone passionately wanting a family with you. Someone trying to speak their truth and tell you to trying to change the way you feel about them. And they are wanting a home life with you and lovers is here. You're the lovers. Whatever. Um, clarify the devil. Clarify this passionate home that someone wants with the collective. Clarify this passionate home. Oh, nothing. A knight of pentacles. Someone that's false or fake. <coughs> the metal tin man that guard himself or uses his money to protect himself in and out. Do it for the public. Do it for the people. Egotistical, prideful. They'll step on anyone to get to money. They're in and out. They're still young. They're still learning. They're still immature. And they call themselves one to offer you. They've been stalking you. And there's someone that broke your heart in the past. Page of Cups. They want to come in. They got one foot in, one foot out. They want to offer their cup to you. They've been stalking you, watching you. They're quite immature. They don't really know what they want. If they want to stay in this for long term. And nights, they're not going to. They're going to be in and they're going to be out. This is a person that is never going to be settled with you in a long-term connection. So if it's a night coming towards you and it's just for money, it's just for money. It may be for money and sex, but that is so weird or whatever. Um, you got two people willing to fight over you knowing they're not doing it for long-term. And, you know, the universe wants them to prove themselves. They can't just come towards you and think that it's going to be something because it's not or whatever. You're not having it. You've learned your lesson. And a lot of you guys are guarded or whatever towards this sort of behavior. And you, a lot of you guys got these people blocked or whatever. So, ooh. This fell out. Someone is a fake friend. I don't know who you got around you, but they're not really your friend. Or whatever. People are weird. I don't know what they're doing in life, but they are sickening. Girl, get your get your energy up and quit trying to get your body up on the outer surface or whatever to uh, Taurus is involved. Get your energy up. If you're going to get your body up and want this fake, this 
big ass boobs and big ass booties or whatever. Get your energy up. At least if you're going to try to do the outer surface, work on your inner surface. Work on healing and your insecurities and competing with people and lying and cheating and stealing and trying to one up people. This is your divine feminine who broke your heart, who who you broke their heart. A Virgo is involved. It was a Taurus and a Virgo involved. What I'm getting is a Taur Taurus could want to come towards you. Or what I'm getting is a Taurus may be someone's divine partner. And a Virgo, a Gemini also is in this. What I'm getting is this person puts you in a third party situation. And it could be with a Taurus and a Virgo. And you're the divine film. The Gemini is a divine film here. That's all we're going to take over here. Someone had put you in a third party situation and it was two other people involved. It could have been a Taurus and a Virgo that was involved in this. That could be the secret right now. What else? Stuck in a relationship for financial purposes with for kids, sexual addiction, sleeping around, unhealed, unhealed, unawakened, spiritually blind. His friend don't want y'all together, nor his family. So, someone don't want y'all together. Please unblock me and accept my apology. Someone is saying, I got to go because it's a lot of other stuff that I got to work on. Honey, I am not paying attention to nobody uh, but my collective on YouTube. I don't have time to be playing hard, horse playing around. I got so much other stuff to do in life other than try to use my energy to try to compete and knock someone off their pivot. Honey, that ain't going to get me nowhere. Those are the things I do not deal with. So people will be fighting with they, them themselves. If they think they're fighting with me, they're going to be getting ignored. Each lily of forgiveness offers all the world the silent miracle of love. Forgiveness offers everything I want. See, y'all, the message is coming out quite right. Go on and forgive and... Um, someone wants to come towards you that has created an illusion or let's see what that is about a O two O's a Q, a U, a T not out not O-U-T. Shot. Pout. Someone is a pout. Drought. Huh. Can you take me home? Because I need to go get.
Okay. Route pout. Someone's a pout. A nine to be significant. Not. 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 Nine is selected a Q, a F, a R, a S, a P, a K. But it's spelling out route. You may need to go look for a situation on the route. Not out or pout. Someone is a pout. And that's all they do. It's pow, pow, pow. Is it you collected? Because I know I've been pouting. <laughs> okay, bye, guys. If you don't mind, if you like and subscribe, I would appreciate it. God bless. Have a great day.